Hi, I'm Annabelle. And I'm Rose. And today we're making an anchovy crostini from our new book, Summer at Home. And this is such a brilliant recipe because sometimes when you have people coming over for drinks that you weren't expecting, you want to be able to whip something out to feed them. This is it. So crostini bases, and then Rose can talk you through this delicious bean puree. Roasted peppers, which you can buy jarred or roast your own. And then hero delicious anchovies. Yum. So the bean puree is kind of like a riff on a hummus. We've just blitzed some uh, butter, butter beans bean. with smoked paprika, quite a lot of olive oil and garlic and salt. It's super, super simple. You could use store-bought hummus if you were in a real rush. real rush, but it's sort of the same. And then we've got our beautiful pepper that I'm just going to cut into thin strips. See? And it looks like, the thing that I love about these crostini is it looks like something that you'd get at a really beautiful wine bar. Um, but you can just make it yourself at home and it's, um, it looks beautiful, it's super easy, relatively inexpensive and incredibly delicious. <laughs> and while Rose is chopping those, I've got these amazing anchovies. And it's like a lot of things, it's worth paying the money to get really good quality anchovies. So these, I'm just going to cut them in half lengthwise because unless you're a real anchovy aficionado, you won't want to eat a whole anchovy and it also makes it a lot less, it looks a lot more extravagant. And then now I've got these all chopped up, Bella's cutting up those, we're going to take our crostinis and you just want to smear about that much on each. And that's actually quite a good trick to know how to do an elegant smear which took me a while to learn. So you want to get a big spoonful and you kind of dollop it on one end and then you scrape it like that so it looks pretty. I'm just going to pile some rocket on the platter just to put them on and again this is something that you can have washed and dried and in the fridge to stay nice and crisp so get that out as a wee base should we start a little production line start a wee production line <laughs> they're just actually so pretty <laughs> i love them and i love the fact that they're so easy yeah. and that combination of flavors with that roasted red pepper and that creamy puree and that tangy anchovy is just so good. And if you really didn't like anchovies, you could do this just with the bean paste and a roasted red pepper if you like. We won't hold it against you, but <laughs> you're missing out. You're missing out. <laughs> Feels like a party. <laughs> Enjoy.